Hi guys, great day. This is Ryan and welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to do something very very easy and very very essential to those who want to edit videos on their phone and we're going to use a very simple simple editing platform app which is Adobe Premiere Clip. So before anything else, I would like to request you to just please click on the subscribe button so we're gonna be like I'm going to 2,000 subscribers now and of course we, I have useful tutorials daily vlogs travel vlogs and all those stuff so now we're gonna go back to our tutorial thank you and please like this video so I'm gonna use Adobe Premiere Clip so this is a very easy easy thing easy easy app to use so we're gonna open it and uh, just this morning i recorded some clips for us to use in this tutorial so if you're one of those uh, persons who who does uh, video editing on their their devices i would like to show you how it's done so we're just gonna see we're gonna go to camera i've recorded some stuff and of course, we're not going to use all of them, but uh, where's that? We're just going to use the, some of the clips just to show you how it's done. So I think I have it here. Anyway, guys, uh, so the gallery shows up the moment you say that you're going to add, uh, you're going to add up your, what you call that, you're going to add up your, your clips so here you go I have clips here this is gonna be part of my vlog in which I'm gonna upload maybe soon so let's try okay I'm gonna try this so you're gonna select the clips there it's gonna hi highlight it like in this purple color so I'm gonna do this like that and of course let's see uh, let's try this one then this one this one okay basically I, I just have to select uh, right there all right I think that's all and right there so we have selected 14 clips us as soon as you've selected those clips on your gallery you press the done and then automatically you have this choose project type so if you want it to be preform you can use preform and of course if you want it automatic so it's kind of like uh, it will generate automatically the music, the pace, the order. So I think we're going to try pre-form free form this time. So trying pre-form, free form. All right, we're going to wait for it. And here you go. So in this clip, basically, less there. If you want to trim clips, you just have right there the help there are help bubbles right there so it can help you out so if you want to trim clips you want to do finger drag let's just skip those so if you want to because i'm going to explain it to you if you want to trim some clips you have to go here and then let's see you can just trim it by using this one these arrows right there so i want to trim that all right so that's good to go then you have another clip when i just trim that like usually i trim clips like i don't start the clip automatically just start like that like right, that a little bit of trimming so okay uh, i think that's good to go so basically now you know how to trim clips and uh, let's okay and let's got it okay let's just so in this uh, tutorial, it's just a very simple tutorial. So we're just going to trim some clips, cut some stuff. Okay, this is like good for one minute. So we're going to stop that. This is 4 sec uh, 54. This is fast. So I'll just take a portion of that. I guess I use. Okay. Okay, let's see. Now for the shoe. Right, some clips there. You just have to cut out these clips. cancel so let's just allow it all right and then here you go right there of course it goes there 
there's just a simple thing there so that's how you trim it now one of the questions that we ask how what if I reorder my clips so you just have to click on that and drag it I think you have to just place it somewhere right there all right right there so you have to drag it like for example I have to reorder this as long as yeah that's very easy right so we can reorder our clips double so let's try it again you click long press on it and then there you go all right the clips reordered so this is the order of the clip now if you want to edit the individual clips for example this here is for the colors so you can edit exposure highlights shadows things like that all right so we get back to there so you can see if you click that <coughs> first stop there right there right now I want to teach you how to um, automatically add filters so if you want to add filters there's this thing in the upper portion I think it's this one and then they we have here the looks that we want so this is basically one feature of the Adobe Premiere clip which I really like because you don't have to color grade your fo uh, your, your your clip so you just have to look for that exact look and feel that you want so I think I want this clip to be like bluish so I'm gonna place that there and get back there so as you can see everything now the clip there has become bluish bluish right there so it's applied to all of the clips right there so the look and feel of your clips now is the bluish feel right so that's for the filter the next that we're gonna do is we're gonna add our music all right there there's some themes preset themes themes music that they have here so let's see what if we use like one of this one like you just have to add that all right if you want to listen to it then you have to add it right there and then it automatically adds to it all right so let's not let's not focus on the clips on this music thing right now but we will focus as long as you had all the clips edited out right there you can now have it previewed you can now export it so let's see let's see what happens all right let's have it previewed right there so there's the clip of me walking then there's the next one next one yeah there's the stuff I think yeah so you can see it's just automatically likes let you preview the stuff okay it walks right there walks right there right okay 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 enough of that I think I'm gonna delete this clip right here yeah so it's very easy basically you're almost done we are almost done with the editing all you need to do now is to click on this upper right portion this thing right there so you have this option save to gallery publish and share share on YouTube before anything else before we share it this is the way we export it so like for example what I always do or what I do is I don't directly upload it I press the save to gallery option so you have X uh, resolution options here export resolution so we're just gonna try 720p because we want, we want it just a smaller one uh, for 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 better you know viewing because most of the time people just views our video people view videos on a small screen so we don't need that high definition stuff as of the moment because we're editing in mobile 
it's gonna take a long time if we're gonna edit it in a higher resolution so 720p let's click continue and then it will save the video this is where it gets long you really have to wait and wait so we have to to wait this is the first time that I'm going to explain this with my voice. So uh, hit the like button. Please subscribe to my channel. And of course, you can skip from this moment on and, and, and see until the video is finished. As of now, I'm starting to do this useful, um, what you call this, useful tutorials. And if you have comments, please comment on the comment section on what editing platform will we try next so this is on mobile version so it's easy if you want to be a youtuber if you want to edit videos want to upload things you don't need a pc right now or a ma or, 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 or a desktop computer all you need to have is your phone what's in your hands and then you can take clips start your own vlog and then now you can upload it immediately in youtube so we have to wait for that hopefully it gets fast anyway if you want just please click the subscribe button click the notification icon and then please share this video if you find it useful actually right now in one of uh, this is this is one of my highest uh, viewed videos the useful tutorials using adobe premiere clip all right so we're gonna wait so uh what platforms are you using and what editing softwares are you using right now so let's wait for it let's really wait for it if you can't wait click the skip all right <laughs> anyway guys thank you very much for watching this video hopefully you've learned something so as we wait Let's really, really, really wait. You know, waiting is quite hard to do, but sometimes in life you need to wait. All right. This is going to make the video longer, but it's okay. It's all worth it. Of course, saving the video depends upon the speed of your unit, the speed of your smartphone, or the speed, or even the size of your clips. So if your clip is too big, too long, then it will take longer. And of course, if your smartphone or your phone that you have is not that uh, high end, it's going to take a long time. All right. So we're almost there, guys. And thanks for waiting. Please click the like button. Please click the subscribe button. We're almost there. We're almost there. All right. If you really want to see more of my videos doing this. You know more than just the visuals and stuff i really want to let you know that i'm doing this video to help you guys do it your way the easy way all right video is saved so we click ok and then we're gonna look for the video all right and let's see how it looks all right so do i have videos here so let's look for the video albums right i can't find it here all right let's see let's see here you go right there so basically it's just 31 31 seconds so right there see the quality is good and of course there you can see uh all right it's a bit shaky because i don't didn't use any stabilizer right there all right so the clip basically is done and it's good to go so that's all about it let's not uh, look at it any further now anyway guys thank you very much for watching we've uh, used adobe premiere clip that's the easiest way to do it so export the clip and then reorder all right we're gonna get back again so when we start a project we click this plus button right here right here right here and then you export the clip and then you reorder the clip right there so what we did was we reorder we we crop we add music filters or the looks here that would apply and then we click 
export if we are contented with what we've done so thank you very much please click that subscribe button subscribe to my channel this is ryan for useful tutorials and i want to see you on my next video hopefully if you have any suggestions on what platform we're going to use so this is ryan from useful tutorials so just comment it and we're gonna let's see if we can do it so thank you very much guys and have a pleasant day i'm gonna stop recording now and as i always say the best is coming great day